Okay guys, in today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to hit a 100 mile an hour serve. Especially if you're somewhere around the 85 mile an hour serve, I think I can get you at a 100 mile an hour serve. You get the elements that I'm talking about in this video. Today we're gonna be talking about the ingredients to a big power serve. Those serves that can go in the box, crush in the fence, get free points, ace your opponent, be one of the better servers in your area. Watch this video if that sounds good to you. Let's get started. All right, let's jump right into this. Okay, so ingredient number one is you do want to learn how to sync up your whole body. Something called the kinetic chain. What is the kinetic chain? You probably heard it before. It sounds confusing, but what it is, is basically working on power as I walk away, so you can see my legs, from the ground up. And it's a chain because it's a sequence of events that comes from the ground building power up into the racket. And so if you have a leak anywhere in your kinetic chain, if something breaks down, if something, if the timing's a little out of sync, then you're gonna be taking away miles per hour on your serve. So you want it all to flow. And I really like to teach people to start learning how to really build their power, not only from the ground up, but also on the ground. So when you start serving, you really feel how to power your legs into the ball. Eventually you want to add a jump, but learning how to come here, go back first. A lot of people don't go back enough, right? And then feel the power sink into the ground and then feel your hip start to push up into the ball. That's what you want to do. You really want to feel that hip. If you don't feel power, a rotational power from here up into there, you're not going to be able to, to get a big serve because you're not using the kinetic chain. So the first part of the serve where I really feel the kinetic chain start to take place is in the legs, the flow of the legs going from back and then the hips pushing in and up. See, it's pushing in and upwards as I hit that, and that's really gonna help me. So even if I don't jump, I'm gonna come here, I'm really gonna turn that toe, kinda like a golfer on the driving range, getting ready here, and that's really popping in. It's the same type motion that you wanna feel. So that's the first key to really, really getting a 100 mile an hour serve. The second thing you need to get, I believe, is an optimal toss, okay? So if the toss is too low, it's gonna be hard to really pop that serve uh, because lots of times when you hit, your arm's still gonna be bent. If you have a low toss and then you actually like scrunch into the serve, there's no way you're gonna hit that serve 100 miles an hour. Okay, so your serve has gotta be a certain height. But then if it starts to go up too high, then it takes a longer time. The higher it goes, right, now you gotta wait on it. And then, so you're waiting longer than you really want. And then when it drops, it drops faster. That's, that's making it hard to time, okay? So the higher you throw something, once it starts to come down, boom, it's gonna drop very, very quickly. And to time that, again, with your legs and your timing of your swing, again, this is gonna break lots of times a chain in the link to where you're not optimally using your body. So I like to toss the ball. If I'm reaching my racket at, at the height, I like to toss the ball maybe about that much higher than my full reach. So when the ball reaches the absolute top of the toss, the apex of the toss, and I see the ball stop, then I know it's time to pop. Okay, and that's gonna lead me to the next thing that's gonna really help you get a really great serve with a lot of power. I want to be able to, when I go out of there and I'm building everything up, I wanna be able to reach up at full capacity there. That my shoulder is up here raised and extended. My elbow is straight, there's no bend as I'm hitting the ball. I'm reaching there at the top. If you feel like there's any bend in your arm, you're going to lose a lot of power. So you want to make sure that you're doing all of these elements and then you also want to have great balance that lands inside of the court. I see so many of my students when they're tossing the ball, if they were to just let it 
bounce, it would still be out. It would be past the baseline. You want to make sure that 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 ball toss is inside the court. If you look at all the pros when they serve, they're landing inside of the court. And when they're done, when they land, they have perfect balance. So these are big, big keys that's going to help you be able to eventually get that 100 mile an hour serve. Of course, there's lots more details in there, which I'm going to have for you in my seven day power generator challenge. Plus, we're going to have a lot of drills to help you really do that. Our goal is on day one is to take you to 100 mile an hour serve, especially if you have an 85 mile an hour serve. I'm also going to teach you how to hit a bigger forehand. I'm helping you find the perfect blend of top spin and, and, and power because I find that people either hit the ball too flat and they don't have the control or they have too much spin where they're taking power off of the ball and it's too spinny. But we will find that perfect blend. That's what we're going to do on day two. Day three, I'm teaching you how to weaponize your backhand. On day four, what we're going to do is we're going to pop and finally stick those forehand volleys. Then we teach you how to stick a backhand volley. Then I'm going to have you pound overheads away and then we're going to put it all together on day seven. So if this sounds good to you, if there's any area of your game that you wish you had more power on, you don't want to miss my seven day power generator challenge. So click up here in the link if you're on YouTube, in the, uh, in the um, sorry, in the card section, and then get the link in the description box. Those are the two ways you can get it. I also put the link in the comment section for you, which should be pinned. So if you like this video, if you think that this makes sense to you, then you know just give a little like here. Like this video up and subscribe so you don't miss my next video. And uh, we'll be back with more power generating videos. This is Pete from Crunch Time Coaching. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you on the next one. It's time to add massive power and spin to your game without having to give up accuracy or consistency. Without having to spend hours and hours on the court every day for the rest of your life, and without having to spend thousands of dollars on tennis lessons that just don't work. My name is Peter Freeman. I'm the founder of Crunch Time Coaching. You may have seen my videos on YouTube where I have over 10 million views, or maybe you've seen me interview the great Rick Macy, Gigi Fernandez, or Rod Laver with my tennis con event that features the very best coaches in the world in an effort to get your game to the next level. Or maybe you've already experienced one of my online training courses. Either way, I'm just a passionate coach that loves helping totally obsessed tennis players get unstuck and get to the next level in their tennis journey. So if you finally want to separate the lies, throw out all the junk and clutter that just holds your game back, you've come to the right place. After playing and coaching now for 40 years, I've compiled everything you need to do to transform your power game this year into a seven day power generator challenge. You see, I focus solely on the totally obsessed adult tennis player. Players that want the latest and greatest cutting edge instruction, proven to get results that local coaches either don't know or refuse to teach. I have now helped 8,757 totally obsessed tennis players inside my training programs, and I'm gonna help you too. Introducing the seven day power generator obsession challenge. You can enroll now and join hundreds of other totally obsessed tennis players just like you live over the next seven days to finally unlock that power you didn't know you had and gain that control and spin you've been missing now for years and turn your tennis game into a true weapon that dominates in match play. When you enroll, you're gonna unlock $1,068 worth of value. Your challenge includes a seven day step-by-step -step video coaching system, perfect practice plan drill seats, and live coaching and support. Plus, I'm throwing in a free bonus, my very best tennis con power tennis lessons, currently only available to VIP members. So if you are sick and tired of hitting weak shots like an amateur and not having the confidence to swing freely regardless of scoreboard pressure, this is the time. You've tried the private lessons that cost tons of money with lackluster results, or you've signed up for dozens of other coaching programs that didn't work, and you're ready to stop this vicious cycle of disappointment and finally learn a simple and doable method that works for myself and for my students. This is the time. Now, enter your information and enroll. It's an insane $1,068 worth of value, yet this is finally where your power transformation begins. Wouldn't it be worth it?